Thank you for coming to check us out again today here at New York Caternix. Today we're going to be making a grilled Italian quail sandwich. I'm going to be sharing with you how I make it. I hope you like it. First comes the pesto mayonnaise. We need a bowl, we need some mayonnaise, and we need some pesto. I'm going to add two parts mayonnaise to one part pesto. Ahead and cover it up and put it in the refrigerator. Now we've got our cutting board out. We're going to cut this pepper. Get right in there. Clean it out. I'm not too excited about these little parts inside, so I always shave those away. Now we're going to cut it into strips, probably about a quarter inch. I'm going to put them in a pan and roast them. Now we have it cut up, put them inside of a pan, put olive oil on top. You can use any kind of olive oil. Extra virgin olive oil would be your best bet. I'm going to use a black truffle extra virgin olive oil because this is my favorite. Mix that up in there. I'm going to use a little salt, a little pepper. That smells really nice. I'm going to put that to the side till we're ready to put it in the oven. Now I'm going to grab my fresh mozzarella cheese. Since I'm only making one sandwich, I'm only going to make a few slices. Uh, maybe four. I like to get them as thin as possible. I'm roasting the red peppers in the oven at 450 degrees probably about 10 minutes. Here's some quail that I've had marinating in Italian dressing for the last couple of hours. I'm going to put that on the grill. I'm going to use this for our Italian chicken sandwich. I'm going to use whole wheat bread for this. It goes good on the grill if you're careful. Okay, as is the case with any other sandwich, we're going to start off with two slices of bread. On the bread goes the pesto mayo that we made earlier. I like to put it on both sides. Once we have the pesto mayo on there, I'm going to put my fresh Parmesan cheese right onto one of the slices of bread. Then I'm going to take those peppers that we fire roasted earlier I'm going to put those right there, all on top. Now we're going to add prosciutto. And last but not least, we are going to put the quail on here. These are pieces of meat that I separated from the breast. So now we have our whole sandwich halfway assembled. Put the two halves together. All right, now our sandwich is together. I'm going to take it outside and press it on the grill. I have my sandwich on the grill. I'm going to leave it about five minutes on each side. All right, now we have our sandwich. Fresh off the grill. 
There you go. All right, thanks again for coming to check us out here at New York Coternix. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave those below. Also, if you have any recipes you'd like to share, also leave those below. Leave a like for the video and please subscribe. We always have new videos coming up. Thank you again from New York Coternix.